Hi kids, today is Tuesday, August 18th, and um, today you're going to start your new story of the week for this week. So first and foremost, you have to do your bell ringer. When you're done with your bell ringer, please review your vocabulary words on the vocabulary sheet that is provided on Google Classroom so that you can um, become familiar with them. Uh, you can use them even while you talk uh, in your own sentences. And also when you take your test on Friday, it will help you if you know them so um, you can get an A on your test. And um, today we're gonna be on page 26 of the textbook and we're gonna read Yoon and the Jade Bracelet. And we're also gonna be reading about her culture, the little girl, her name is Yoon and she, I believe is from China and her family is from there. So she, her culture is a lot different than our culture. So we're gonna be able to learn about her culture and maybe things that they might do different or traditions they might have different than we do here in America. So remember your big question is, what can traditions teach you about culture? So keep that in mind as you're reading Yoon and the Jade Bracelet. When you're done reading Yoon and the Jade Bracelet, you're gonna go ahead and go to your reading writing companion on page 50 and 51, and you're gonna anchor the text. So make sure you complete those two pages in your reading writing companion. And when you're done, uh, while you're doing those two pages, make sure you're using your textbook to help you find the answers. So you can flip back to your textbook. Um, you can even have your textbook open on one tab and your reading writing companion open on the other one so that you can read your textbook while you're trying to answer your questions. And you can use the text and the pictures while you're answering your questions in your reading writing companion. When you're done with that, you're gonna go ahead and click on grammar. And like I said, we're talking about verbs. So um, remember verbs are something that you can do. It's an action word. So what you're gonna do today is um, type in the access code. And once you have access to the sheet, make sure you do both of the sheets. Please make sure you go on the left-hand side and scroll down and there should be two sheets. What you're gonna do is there's a whole bunch of pictures and at the bottom of the pictures, there's a word bank. There's a whole, I think there's like 16 or 12 words. Make sure you use the words in the word bank and you're gonna look at the picture and tell me what action they're doing. So if you see a kid that is sitting down um, and your word bank says sit, you can type in, or you can, yeah, type in sit under the picture. So use a word bank to type in whatever verb or action the picture is doing. If it's, if the kid's jumping and the word bank says jump, type in jump under the picture. Um, once you guys go into the activity, it'll make a little bit more sense um, but when you're done with your grammar, you're done for reading for today, and that's it. Hope you guys have a good day.